Wise of Cause, my name is Altasty, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Last time we started up our uh, metal refinery here, and then noticed that in order for the steam turbine to work, we need to have a bit of water in here. And when I checked my notes later on, it was not the only mistake, because in here um, we also uh, need some more things. So let's break this open as well. Um, we can catch you. Okay. Let's mop up the water in here. Um, then we can actually deconstruct all this wire. Um, and what we need is radiant pipe. Um, we will have to do it with Metal, uh, iron, I mean, and then here um, on this side that will be the uh, intake. And this will be the cooling circuit. Um, we probably also want to get in uh, a bit of uh, hydrogen from somewhere. Now it would be cool to have uh, a hydrogen vent. Because currently we are a bit low on um, on hydrogen. Um, let's break the pipe here. Then connect up here. As long as we are not pumping in anything, it does not really matter to have the pipe connected. But this means we have to do the cooling setup, um, which means we have to break out this part here, get in all the uh, outer fluids, water, and then I think uh, we will have a floor or a ceiling a capping off the tank on here, but then we will have uh, a space in between the the cooling setup and the cooling container and that way um, we
can walk uh, our way through. And now that the uh, polluted water is out, we can actually uh, build up the wall here, finish that. Um, and then... Continue with the with the wiring on this side. Um, I would imagine that it goes down somewhere here, and then in this area we will have the uh, actual cooling setup. here we need around 200 kilograms of water on the floor currently we have less than one kilogram that's because all the water flows in here in in this gap um, which will only stop once we have filled this gap here with uh, 1000 kilograms per tile. So we are nearly there, but not quite. Uh, hopefully we are not using all the water that is in here. Because we need that for our farm. Otherwise, we have a whole lot of uh, other problems. If worse comes to worse, we can still reactivate uh, this setup here. Uh, refining more iron we have dug our way on this side so uh, let's see there's another cold biome over on this side it gets a bit warm and over here there is nothing up to uh, that point uh, which is the uh, another uh, steam vent and we will use that one um, uh, for the water that we need for the uh, for the oil well uh, to pump out the oil there I think I heard the portal so let's see we will take the plastic even if we do have a draglet farm that produces plastic um, it's not too fast so getting a bit of extra plastic is a nice thing Um, we will need some normal floor here and the ladder there because pipe will go down. Okay, so we have uh, ladders all the way through and we can dig in here and empty that part. Um, do the same here. And dig over 
here to get that water in as well. And then we will see if this is sufficient to fill up the container. Probably not. But it empties out the uh, room up here. Um, so we can actually uh, work on the uh, cooling setup. Just going in. And now we should see, yeah. Now we are almost at 100 kilogram per tile. So that part should be fixed pretty soon. problem with this one is that there is uh, salt water down here. So maybe if we go in from this side. down there we could create an artificial uh, basin to catch the catch the water all right we should not have any more uh, metal queued up here because um, if you produce metal with the uh, rock crusher you put in uh, 100 kilograms of ore and you only get 50 kilograms out as if you do the same thing with the uh, refinery you put in 100 kilograms and you get out 100 kilograms so it's more efficient right uh, we are over uh, 100 200 kilograms so um, we can uh, close this part off um, should probably pick up the iron ore that's lying around in here it's just too valuable to let it playing around. Okay, uh, I built this part. I think we do have a bit more uh, plastic uh, over one ton, or we had over one ton, but we can build a few more beds that will make our duplicates happy. Um, so this one will be for Devon. Uh, 
and then um, Harold and it's bit. Which means all this we can remove. And we will have another set of uh, bedrooms over on this side. Probably the uh, will not match exactly like uh, we did on this side we could fit in uh, three equal bedrooms uh, but let's see um, let's start with the sculpting block and that and uh, plant. then we will have a door and then one okay that will not work so on this side we will have something a bit different. Um, of course, we can also put in the paintings. We'll replace this door with uh, airflow tiles, so we can place a uh, decorative corner there. And that used up all the uh, plastic that we have. All right, the uh, add port went in. We can continue with our pie pitch. There is something new in here. Um, we will take the bowl and make barbecue out of it. This barbecue is tasty. Then let's put in that corner piece. Pick up all that's lying around. We'll probably need it. Um, do we have 
have room? Yes, we have room for a uh, stove. Uh, this one, however, also needs gas. But we have it over on this side. So. Which means with the uh, gas range, that's how it's called, but basically it's an oven for a stove. Uh, with that, uh, we can make better food. But it looks like uh, they are taking uh, their good time um, to, uh, to fix this. Um, so we will see how we proceed up here in the next episode. So hope you enjoyed this one and join me next time for Oxygen Not Included. Goodbye!